storm the Capitol? Did you? Uh... No, I didn't know the violence. I'm sorry? I didn't know violence. I know nothing. I'm not affiliated with anything. Nothing. It's just that this country is for corruption. And we're the American government is, is against our, uh, the people. You know? Nobody in the Black Lives Matter. It was a fraudulent election. before 9 p.m. on election day. When people are coming in at 4 o'clock and stuffing ballots, that is an illegal. It is an illegal election, and if you care, if you don't care about that, you do not care about your children's rights, and you do not care about your children's anything. Thank you. Yep. Awesome. Just to keep in mind, for, for all of you guys, there is a U.S. Marshal, a U.S. Marshal in there, named Melanie, that literally says, "How does it feel to live under a communist country?" U.S. Marshal, she would refu refuse to give me, refuse to give me her ID code, her badge number, refuse to tell me her full name, but she told me, "How does it feel to live in a communist country?" And we're, this is the U.S. Marshal building. So. This is what we're living through. Communism in America. And it's not okay. It's not okay. You know, we have, an, we have an amendment right to use, and it's called the First Amendment, for corruption of government. And that's exactly what's happening right now. Good luck, buddy. Thank you. I don't need good luck, I got God. I'd like to see you guys report the truth. Why don't you guys interview me? U.S. Marshal in this building. I don't have her full name because she refused to give it to me and refused to give me her badge ID. U.S. Marshal, I asked her, how does it feel to serve under a communist country now? And she said, how does it feel to live under one? That's our, U that's our U.S. Marshals. 